Hi, this is Jay. Welcome to Midnight Ride. Uh, good Eve. Let's talk about growth. So, in terms of growth, um, it depends on your perspective, on one's perspective. But this works for me. And I hope this works for you as well. And if it worked, kindly leave a like, share, leave a comment. If you have best practices that you can add up, please do. Please do comment it just so we could have a sharing, indirect sharing and communication with each other. Everyone can learn from you and I can learn from you as well. Thank you very much. So let's begin. In terms of growth, um, there's just a few things that I have. Um, well, number one, uh, self, of course, it, it begins with, your, with, with yourself. And then number two, uh, passion. Third would be implementation of your passion. Uh, means the action. And then, of course, at the end of it, outcome. So, let's start. Self. Self, in terms, it's like, um, it's like you're beginning to know yourself better. For you to be able to uh, prioritize the best things to know and acknowledge your behavior, your attitude towards any given situation. So yourself is important to this part because knowing yourself better would uh, make it easier or would make it easy for you to tackle all of those um, challenges that would be ahead in terms of your growth. So that's one. Um, we'll talk about it. We'll talk about self in a much more um, deliberate way and a more stringent explanation. Uh, for now, let's just talk about growth. So yeah, that's self. That's one. Number two would be passion. So once you know um, your strengths, your weaknesses, um, and the things that you like you don't like and anything in between um, let, let's go to passion because passion will then be um, the goal that you'll be having it's like um, planning a house uh, and you're seeing your house as for example um, a modern contemporary um, house design or an apartment so it's like you setting up the goal um, depending on, to, on what you wanted to see so that's passion for me because it fuels you to move forward it fuels you to um, create interventions and steps for you to be able to get that certain goal that certain passion that you have it promotes you to push forward it promotes you to create more action plan um, it creates uh, it promotes you to um, create a plan to, to create new stuff that would you know uh, rewire you to move forward to step forward and also if ever there's stresses or a little bump in your road technically um, passion would um, alleviate all of those stresses for you to move forward so that's 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 the second passion or that your fuel next would be implementation so once you have your goal it's uh, we almost tackled it during passion that you know you're you're gonna be creating the step-by-step -step plan for you to get the the goal that you're looking forward into so for example um, passion or uh, self would be um, the key skills for you to either draw the plan for your house and then passion would be the, the creative phase wherein you draw you plan on what the goal is and then um, 
implementation would be um, the application from the design or the drawing so you apply everything that you draw that you created that you planned that you plan uh, for 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 the, the goal to to be met okay so uh, that's third um, implementation or the action for uh, the said goal or the said passion that you have and then lastly of course conclusion if you are seeing yourself if you're suffering enough actually not suffering if you're enduring enough um, for you to get the goal that you're des desiring to you have to see it through no matter how painful it is no matter how hard the, the, the road gets you into, no matter how long it is, you have to push forward and see it through. Don't waste your time. Um, sometimes, there's also some situation wherein um, you weren't able to meet your goal because it's either it's too hard for you to get it or you need some people to assist you in it. But at least... Uh, you were able to grasp the the system on how to get there that's the least and at least you got the exposure and experience to get it through so again in order for you to move forward to grow on yourself there's only four that is that worked out for me again this is only for uh, on my end and it depends on you so it, when 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 we studied architecture before um it's like the professor would promote self step one promote self of course if you're in an, ar an architectural student um there are basic skills it's like you 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 got the course of architecture or fine arts because that's what you decide right so the the professor or your professor would give out the specific skill sets that you'll be needing in terms of the drawing in terms of the project so once the the order has been given or once you have a specific um, just of what your target is then you proceed with passion once you proceeded with passion, you go, you move forward from it, and then you strategize. Or what are the uh, what are you looking into at the end of the? It's like a for. It's like you're foreseeing your future in terms of this path. That's passion. That's fuel. That's that's what your your driving force would come from. So that second. And then third would be implementation. So uh, passion, that's the that's the design phase. You're designing um, you're designing your goal, you're you're strategizing and you know you're you're planning as a whole. Implementation or action, you 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 start to um, do some specific actions that is um, that you plan from the design phase or the passion phase and then you 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 it's action technically and specifically it's action you you just have to move your pieces you have to have the discipline to um, get in the morning start with your goals or start moving your 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 pieces to uh, the desired um, outcome per day uh, you know uh, setting up your uh, short term goals for you to attain the long term goal um, getting it done daily if not daily at least small progress would do just so you could have yourself moving one step at a time and then of course lastly would again seeing it through or seeing yourself where your passion leads you to again at the end of the day you just have to see it through no matter again no matter how painful it is 
No matter how you suffer from that long road, no matter how long it did take, go back to step one and two. Look into yourself, your skills, your 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 behavior, your attitude, and then go back to your passion to fuel yourself forward. If you're hurt, and then you just you know reevaluate yourself if you're in that part wherein you're a bit messed up. But again. If you're, you're following those four and you're in it, you're not messed up. You're already in your path. You just have to continue, push forward, and then have the guts. Thank you very much. That's it. Have a great night and uh, thank you for listening. And um, yeah, leave a comment, subscribe, and I'm um, looking forward to seeing you guys in the future. Thank you, thank you, and thank you.